Hello everyone, this is Melanie again. So today I will be talking about refusals, um, in particular uh, for settlement applications or spouse and partner visa applications. So uh, if an application is refused, um, then usually they are given a right of appeal um, and they have 28 days to appeal to the immigration tribunal. Um, now, the, it's usually the sponsor who appeals against the decision because it's the sponsor who is based in the UK. Um, then you have two options, whether to uh, have an oral hearing, which means that uh, you will have a, a hearing in front of an immigration judge um, and it will be list there will be a hearing date listed, um, or you can have a paper hearing which means that um, the immigration judge will just look at the papers or the documents that you submit uh, to them um, in support of your appeal. Uh, now, usually if you are appealing, um, the disadvantage of doing so is that you could be waiting up to a year um, for the judge to, you know, to consider your case. Um, so that's something to bear in mind. Um, it really does depend on each case, you know, whether or not you should appeal against the decision. Um, so, you know, that the, that will require a review from, you know, a UK immigration solicitor. Um, the other option is to not appeal and to just submit a fresh application. Um, and again, the disadvantage, I guess, would be to having to pay a separate fee again uh, to the Home Office and also a fee for the immigration health surcharge um, but the advantage is that you don't have to wait um, a year you know in comparison to appealing um, you could be waiting up to four months for a decision from the home office thank you